so you want to know some tips and tricks for combat warriors well boys i'm going to show you some of my favorite tips and tricks in combat warriors that you is these tips will maybe help you get better at the game they'll maybe uh they may be stuff that you've never even heard before but boys let's jump into this um let me think okay so number one man i've said this a million times uh use freaking heavy weapons i'm just gonna go over this super quick don't use light weapons when you're a noob okay once you're once you unlock a bunch of heavy weapons then use the light weapons you're not gonna learn how to really play the game like good players if you just use light weapons all right boys and while we're on the topic of combat let me just say this all right boys so what you don't want to do is run straight up to somebody and just hit them right away when they literally see you coming from a mile away if you do that it's literally the easiest way to get parried in the game bro like look if i just go Ooh. watch this double kill whoa how did he get up but yeah boys don't just run right up to somebody and try to swing at them like that it's not the best thing to do but yeah guys don't run straight at people and try to hit them like that uh it's working for some reason right now usually it doesn't work uh yeah i don't know what's going on with this server man oh, how that did not hit me all right boys now let's do a non-combat tip so i've actually made a video on this before it's how to super jump dude super jumping in this game is amazing it's helped me so many times like dude literally like let's say like you get low oh no i'm low i need to run up here like dude you can literally fling yourself up here and then nobody can hurt you unless they throw a c4 but yeah boys you can literally do tactics like this you can run out of the tree hit people kill them all right boys so how to super jump so what you're gonna want to do is uh you're gonna need an fps unlocker number one number two you need to have shift lock on like this and then number three you're gonna need to be sprinting number four you're gonna need to sprint and roll and then essentially the last step that you're gonna want to do is uh sprint roll and then right when your head hits the ground like mid roll you're gonna want to spin one direction not like this you're not gonna want to go like that you want to spin one direction and then jump at the exact same time so like literally just like this and uh yeah you you super jump it actually takes a while to like master this so if you can't get it right away or if it takes you literally like an hour to figure out uh yeah it's it's all about timing and it does take a lot of time to learn how to do it but yeah boys let me tell you some more like combat tips what is going on right here so a really good combat tip that i just did in my combat guide is uh the strategy to like have like a higher chance to hit somebody which is literally to like run and then swing like that what you're gonna want to do is when you do swing you just do like a full 360 multiple times what is going on over here what are you doing man what's going on no and that's why you don't rush in right away that's why you don't rush in and hit because you get parried i literally don't even follow my own tips i'm a goober all right boys so another combat tip is to use the best utilities in the game so essentially you're gonna want to use like a kunai a c4 or a ghost potion and the ghost potion is actually one that i use just to kind of like troll i'll show you what i do with it right now okay so to do this you need to have the ability to super jump so i'm gonna come over here what are these guys doing so what i'm gonna do is i want to pick them off so what i want to do oh god oh that was close so now as you can see i have made them angry and uh, i've also maybe made this guy angry dude why is nobody angry at me i just smashed you in the face with a freaking axe or a dragon slayer i'm stupid so now that this man is angry at me what i want to do is hop up in this tree take the ghost potion so he can't see me take it scroll right back down and dude he literally did not even see me coming it's kind of an evil thing to do but it's also really funny so uh i do it all the time all right so i guess another tip is to literally like be moving constantly you want to utilize like running around shifting rolling all of this but you want to be able to utilize like rolling you want to be able to utilize like running and uh, doing that sliding but boys the reason why movement is so important is that if you're always moving number one it's gonna be hard to hit you with like a kunai or like a grenade or like a c4 all right bro so i'm gonna go back to another trick since there's a lot of tips already on youtube i want to show some tricks so stuff that not like tip videos usually show and uh one of them i'm gonna have to find somebody pretty low to demonstrate on all right if you get somebody low like this you can force glory kill them they don't even have to be on the ground to be able to force glory kill they just have to be oh my gosh they don't even have to be on the ground to be able to force glory kill you literally just have to get them low dude all right so i showed this one in my tips video as well um there is a thing that's called debug mode essentially if you click this little cog wheel right here you can bring this settings thing up and turn on debug mode and with debug mode you can see 
like the swing radius of your sword so essentially you can see how spinning in a circle increases like the chance you'll hit somebody so yeah you can see how good the dragon slayers like radius is when i like spin around like this it's like absolutely insane so if you ever get hit by a dragon slayer from like a million miles away that's literally why all right boys so here's a few tricks that you can do on the crossroads map the wild people always try to come for me while i'm like trying to record something like leave me alone whoa what the heck Oh, those eco-friendly shoes, everyone. Hold on, dude. I think that this rank 264 with Headless Horseman just teleported on top of me. But anyways, I'm going to show you the cool things that I have figured out on this map. Uh, what do you think you're doing, mister? All right, boys. So right over here, there is a little spot right here. So I don't know if you've ever noticed this spot. But if you go up here and you look straight forward and you just kind of wiggle around, bro, you can literally, like, make your way down into this spot and have like the best hiding spot in the game. Look, dude, why, why are people trying to get me right now? All right, so the next two spots are actually pretty easy to know and you probably already know about them. So I'll fly through it. Uh, if you kind of like do a little Dougie, uh, you get down in this secret little area. This is another secret area on the map. So if you're ever getting chased, this is a nice little area that you can run and hide too. But yeah, boys, there is like a ton of different tips and tricks in this game. A lot of the best ways to like learn a lot of new things is to literally just like watch people play so like i can go in this like spectator mode and i think it's something that they give content creators in the game but i can like spectate and see like what's going on and stuff and just by like watching like the highest like ranked players in the server you can actually get a good gauge on like what good players do and uh how they fight and all that stuff okay so another useful thing that you could do is uh cancel your sword swing so yeah this is sometimes helpful sometimes it's not but uh there is some occurrences where you can get someone to be baited but uh i don't think it's gonna happen right now <laughs> what where did he go Dude, he just like vanished into thin air. So let's say I wanted to like parry bait this guy. So I'll swing like that and then cancel it. But of course they did not even like flinch. You have to be really quick when you do it. So you'd be like, you're like, uh, cancel. Yeah, there we go. It worked. It's exactly what I wanted to do. Whoa. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Wait, what? No, you're dead. You're dead to me. All of you. All of you are dead to me. Oh, and some other good things to know is to unlock all of your utilities. A lot of people put these off until like the last second, bro. The kunai and the C4 are probably like some of the most used things. But boys, if you enjoyed, make sure to like, subscribe, join the Discord, do all of that fun.